Hello and welcome to a taste and see the cookery show from at your side that makes cooking easy and fun. We have a great recipe today that everybody will love. It's baked fish. I often check out recipes online before we record hours to see how others make a particular dish and almost every recipe I saw for baked fish was so complicated. It really isn't. This recipe, which is courtesy of my wife who credits it to her mother, will show you how easy it is. Before you do that, please hit the subscribe button below and click the bell icon alongside to be notified of new posts on this channel. Now let's bake some fish. That entire bowl got swiped in minutes by four people, even though there were lots of other things to eat on the table. The basa made it particularly tasty, but you can use any white fish with the bones removed. 
If you don't want to use fish, you can use chicken or prawns or veggies instead. And if you want to increase the quantity, add boiled macaroni to it. If you do this, make sure you add a little more cheese. Most of Jesus' apostles were fishermen. Ever wonder why he chose them? I can think of a few reasons. One, they were simple people, uneducated for the most part. Educated people often think they know everything and are consequently unteachable. Two, they had a lot of patience. You can't catch fish if they don't bite, and sometimes they just don't, so you have to stick around for hours. Three, they had persistence. Sometimes, even after fishing for hours, you catch nothing, but the next day you are at it again. Four, they had courage. It's not always peaceful out there, and you're often caught in the middle of storms. Five, they were adaptable. If their favorite places didn't bear any fruit, um, fish, then they just move elsewhere. Simplicity, patience, perseverance, courage, and adaptability. Do you have what it takes to be a fisher of men? Today is especially a good day to think about this. Merry Christmas.